So San Diego Studios has just released the Legends trailer for MLB 23. So we're going to react to it. It's a short 56 second clip. I haven't watched it yet. I know there's been some leaks and whatnot going around. I've tried not to spoil it for myself for the most part, but it's always so hard with this with the digital world we live in today. Not a David Wright. Oh, that's a big one. Okay. No. Okay. And I came. He'll be Smith. I'm so excited for the. I'm so excited for the Negro League players to be making their way to the game. I feel like it's such a great ad. Chili Davis. I remember him when he was the Red Sox hitting coach. There it is, Derek Jeter, the cover boy. So it's true. So it's true. Oh my goodness. True that Sosa and Maguire are going to be in the game this year. If you guys catch up on the Daily Show that we spoke about it, on the Daily Show that there was a TV spot that made the rounds on Twitter. This opens the door for so many more players to be making their way into, into the game that people a few years ago probably would have thought would have never happened. That allows me to hold out hope that Manny Ramirez and Alex Rodriguez will find their way into the game at some point. Sosa and McGuire, man, my goodness. Those cards are gonna be absolutely just disgusting disgusting imagine having those guys back to back in your lineup that's just insane yeah from what i saw i saw about maybe i believe 15 16 legends that were named throughout the video so i believe they said something about 25 legends or i believe somebody did the math and said 25 legends or new legends should be making their way into the game but again my math could be off but i wouldn't put it past san diego studios be withholding a legend or two from a video like this because there was the same story with larry walker when he debuted in the game i believe it was mlb 21. he wasn't announced for the game before the game launched he was actually announced i believe maybe june or july through one of the feature programs and he was a new legend so they like announcing new legends as the game is still active in its life cycle i'm excited to see players like satchel page and john donaldson and be and seeing how those guys with that whole new storylines mode as well as being able to use them in diamond dynasty i think they're going to be very usable and very versatile i feel like they're going to add a new layer to just the team building in diamond dynasty especially the way they're going about it when they're releasing 99 overalls are just super high overalls if you play enough you will have yourself really good teams very very quickly i wonder what that's gonna mean for sosa and mcguire i wonder if they're gonna have them be behind a collection of some sort because what they usually do is allow players for diamond dynasty on day one they give everybody a pack that is a legends pack so you'll be able to get yourself one of the new legends to use off off the rip but I'm not sure how they're going to go about Maguire and Sosa. If they're going to allow us to get a version of them on day one. It's something to get the fans excited. It's definitely gotten me a lot more hype for the game. I'm more excited to see how the gameplay is going to change. Because using the tech test as a as kind of a, a preview, I don't really look at it like that. To be honest, I look at when the game fully comes out as its full representation of how the gameplay is. Because the tech test is just more the last year's game with the new features they're trying to implement so they still have to iron out a lot of things so i i only use the tech tests as kind of just just seeing how some of the new features could work in theory we would have to see how it works in practice when the game actually drops this friday the, the attention to detail for the older legend kind of gloves they're using and that, that whole kind of thing i always like that attention to detail in sports games something i had a big problem with when it comes to games like 2k and mlb is when they're using younger versions of current or recently retired players and they just look the same but just like their jersey number switched or something stupid like that i feel that attention to detail goes a long way i'm a big advocate on attention to detail when it comes to player models and just how uh, games are especially with sports games anyway other than that i'm just excited to get my hands on the game and just seeing some of the guys that are going to be in there david wright chili davis chili davis i know he had himself a pretty solid career i believe in a near 20 year career he had himself 350 career home runs playing for three different teams i believe more like i believe five yeah i do remember him as the red sox hitting coach for a few seasons it's so fun for me to be able to have a learning experience when it comes to playing these kinds of games or playing sports games in general learning about 
and guys who paved the way for players I love watching today. Never heard who Hilton Smith was, so I'm excited to get to learn more about him and learn about more of that time in baseball. Glad that those kinds of players in that era is getting its due. But just the, the sheer fact that Sosa and Maguire are, it's just like two pillars of one of the most controversial times in baseball history and one of the most fun times in baseball history from a lot of fans' point of view, it just opens the door for just like new possibilities to go forward in terms of content being introduced into MLB The Show in future installments of the game, not even just this year. Let me know you guys' thoughts about the Legends trailer for MLB 23. The game drops this Friday and I'm super excited to get my hands on it in terms of just excited to see how gameplay is gonna, gonna be a factor and how things are gonna change up in that regard, as well as the new Legends that are gonna be introduced into the game this year. And let me know who's your favorite Legend, who you most looking forward to in terms of playing, are you gonna even be picking up the game? Just give me your thoughts and opinions down below and be sure to support the channel and like this video if you did enjoy and make sure you subscribe and support us over at VendettaSportsMedia.com to stay up to date with all your favorite sports. With that being said, stay safe out there and I'll talk to you guys real soon.